What is good everybody and welcome back to Two Point Hospital. I know it's been a couple days since I uh, last uploaded. I was gone during a long weekend, Labor Day weekend, uh, out visiting my parents. And I just kind of the week prior, you know, ran out of time to record. I recorded as many videos as I could possible, but I unfortunately ran out of time. And so we only got up to, I think, Saturday. Um that I recorded in advance so I mean it is what it is these videos I mean they take time I'm like uh, well both the editing and then even just the gameplay like it just takes like when I'm like chopping up these videos and starting to edit it's like hour 20 hour 30 minute long video before it gets chopped up so it's, the stuff some of the progress things just take time like some of the objectives that we are given uh, by the by the game um so yeah sorry about that but i'm back should be back to getting uploading daily uh, i'm torn if i should just buy some dlcs or not to continue out because i really enjoy playing this game like it's really do have fun um wonder if these hospitals are going to open up at all if that's also DLC, I don't know. But I think they should just open up because they have the they have the H, they have the hospital symbol. Whereas this is just in this DLC is just in the middle of nowhere over this rift. But who knows? I guess we'll find out because we're moving on to unfortunately I do not have I did not get done any of the uh hospital construction um like finishing up hospitals so that's still going to be in the works at some point i will get that video out we'll go on ho maybe we'll just wait and we'll go on hospital tours all around the county all the finished hospitals but today we're going to move on to flemington which is our new hospital location uh it's in the wealthy t it's in the wealthy town of flemington it's just well, maybe we should make some big bucks Maybe we should up our prices, our consultations, and make people pay. Pay for the doctors, you know, make them pay, make them pay. Let's see, Flemington Hospital, welcome to Flemington, a wealthy town where the people have more money than sense. I think we could make a killing here, pardon the expression. If we can get ourselves a marketing license, we can use marketing campaigns to improve our reputation, attract more patients, and recruit better staff. I suggest we focus our research and marketing on an illness that has been plaguing the area for a while, animal magnetism. This part of the county is cold, we'll need to put in some heaters to keep them warm. Oh yes, Let's see what we're working with here. We got this, is this a plot of land? This is, this part is not, but this parking lot is. 60,000. I guess it is plus a thousand meters. This is right around a thousand. 864. That's right in the middle, so that's 55. What is the numbering? What is the logic behind numbering? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. What is the logic here? I have no idea. Is this I uh, lost for words? I have no idea how they decided to do that, but they did. Well, looks like we have pretty uh, basic setup here. We have to get done, which I will get after right now, I guess. Just for starters, before I forget. Receptionist right here. Okay, I don't know why they're just random items, but... Oh, because I'm still trying to build the building, that would be why. That's good. This heats up the whole building. Butcher's expensive, so we're just 
We'll just ignore that for now. This is what I wanted. Before we forget, welcome to Sonic's Hospital. Alright, I will get started on the brooms and getting a hospital up and running. Um, so then I'll see you guys in a bit. Alright guys, so we just, uh, or I just, I guess, <clears throat> the construction of the hospital here to get us started. Need some patients to roll through though. That'd be nice. As long as they have some flying in from the helipad. But uh, yeah, we got three GP offices right now, a general diagnosis room, staff room on this side, and a pharmacy and a cardiology room on this side. We got a L-shaped reception desk out front to uh, greet any patients that uh, come this way. Which so far are none. Nobody has anything to do. So that's good. You'll have to build a hospital with zero patients involved. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll make some money here soon. We got our first customer coming in. Might have to take out a loan here. We'll see. Uh, I guess you just, just walk. They just walk in from wherever, I guess. Thought they'd be coming in here, so that's why I put it here, but I guess not. For you and me. Congratulations. You are one of the many poorly educated oh, well. adults who make life unbearable. That's okay, we'll get started. Did I, I said I had a reception room, I had toilets in the middle, obviously. Uh, you guys would have spotted that by now, but uh, this is actually nice because this gives me like a uh, two width. Like to say room block. Just to show you physically here. It gives me two room block width hallways. Um yeah. Building along the sides here. So and then this leaves me with four four wide here. In the middle still. So it's nice. Nice and wide. Nice and wide place. Leave me with four wide here. With two wide hallways, it says three, but it's two because I'm in here. Two wide hallways, either side. Um, so that's nice, and then this can scoot all the way back up pretty much to this door. Whatever rooms we find we need in here. Like I could probably put in, uh, what does this person want? Potty mouse. Go to the pharmacy. Uh, <clears throat> Psychiatry or psychiatry. Still don't know what that one happened to. <clears throat> Let's get him to wait. We'll just take a quick pause here. That person's treatment didn't work, but they still pay us. That's the bonus. Probably just stick in here because it's a minimum three by three room. Like this is four wide, so anything like four by four, if we need to get going here go in here and fit quite nicely That's psychiatry we only need three by three there we go diamond cabinet in there Hello bin in there Posters. Try to keep attractiveness up. And it should be attractive enough and warm enough. Comfortable, that's good. And yeah, like on the sides, we can fit set five rooms. One of them being a four by three, so not the end of the world. But here we have four, four by, and then however long we make it, like maybe if we need a ward right away, we'll throw in a ward or fracture ward, or if we need whatever other the big rooms, the uh, 
Not fluid analysis. Oh, we got an x-ray too. We got all those unlocked to research. We need to build one of those at that point because you see how to get our marketing license. We need to diagnose a patient with animal magnetism and we need to complete pest control research. Um, which requires us to build the freaking research lab. Oh, fuck. We need training. We need all of it. But I need to make some money first is the problem. Maybe we'll take out a loan still yet. I don't know. What was I saying here? What's this minimum? This is a minimum of four by four rooms. There you go. Or the deluxe clinic is three. Pan lab is four. Clowns clinic is four. Chromotherapy, four by three. Injection room, three by three. What about fluid analysis, three by three? What if I could go back to my other hospital and do pest control research if it would allow it? Patients have rock bottom. Group of injection patients were kicked out of Jumbo Hospital for not being sufficiently grateful and are now looking for further treatment. Will be rewarded to treat this group of patients should we challenge have them sent here. Challenges to so <laughs> challenge is to six patients with rock bottom. Need the injection room, but we have 90 days to complete it. I'll say yes. Arriving. Let's plop one of those down quickly. At the bottom right, injection room going five by five. Or three five by five, a three by three. Oh, but you can have more injection things in your room. We can put down more jab masters, can we not? Nope, you can. Okay. I just had two but right beside each other. In the previous hospital must have been what it was. Heat and posters. I put a compost in there, I might have. Whoops! Shouldn't have went over there, but you never know. Oh yeah, I could have hopped over there. Yep, sell it. Could have a comfortable room. Yep, and it should be also attractive enough. It's good from here. Let's hire a nurse. That person's dead. Oh, this nurse even has injection abilities. Let's hire her. Let's go ahead and put out some benches all the way back here. So doing fine on heat, right? Yeah, we are. This person's about to die, so that's not great. Okay, well. I won't keep you guys here any longer. I will try to work on getting this marketing license and then talk to you then. And then we'll still have to do objective one. So I will see you in a bit. Because we are about to complete the research for test control. And there we go, we got our marketing license. Great news, the Two Point Health Ministry has granted us a marketing license. This will allow us to run marketing campaigns to improve our host, to improve our reputation and attract more patients and staff to the hospital. Build a marketing room and hire or train an assistant with the marketing qualification to run the campaigns. All right. I'm trying to figure out where to put this this is only oh no this is three i'm gonna put a four by four in there let's go put our oh excuse me we can sneak our pans lab right in this corner here good for, good 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 for us garbage can extinguisher what's this uh, do you want to start now it's, I was just trying to go here Three ten patients except I need to get a training room that's pretty obvious 
People want to be trained and need to be trained. However, you received a gift from Holistics, courtesy of Augustus Lavender. Oh, boy. I was a bit suspicious, so I sent it to the lab. Apparently, it's what's known as a homeopathic poison. It's entirely safe to drink and actually quite tasty. You must really hate us. <clears throat> All we did was impress a VP with a nice hospital. And we've invented a new machine to design. To, to, to the, uh, English is hard. We've invented a new machine designed to tackle animal magnetism. Rewards is a pest control. I'm guessing that's a room. Let's go ahead and just take a look at our one star objective. So we need a hospital value of 1 million. You're almost halfway there, $412,000. Reputation needs to maintain at 70% or above and our current is 82, so that's good. We need to cure 10 patients with animal magnetism, the new researching research project we just finished. And we need to launch a marketing campaign. So, I guess I'll work on that. I just want to finish this uh, pens lab here. Quick. Large radiator to heat it up, heat up the place. I'm going to switch to attractiveness and we'll put a bunch of posters down. Cheapest and effective way to increase your attractiveness in a room or hospital in general. I need to do that. Because although the rooms are very pretty, um, the rest of it is not. Not very pretty at all. Um, so anyways, I don't know what's new here. Probably these two rooms. Maybe the research lab's new. I can't remember. I think maybe psychiatry up. I built a psychiatry room. Or maybe you guys just saw me beginning that. Then I built an injection room because we had a challenge where injection patients come in. And then I built a research lab to get that marketing license objective done. Uh, so then here, oh, excuse me. I decided why not have a little square with this kiosk provides uh, food items for people. <laughs> Looks rather holiday themed, but whatever. And then we have the news agent, which uh, reduces boredom of patients. We've got a bunch of seating here, and we got two drink machines. We got the luxury luxury drink machine, regular drink machine, and snack machine. If you don't want to go get a snack at the cozy kiosk. And a couple drinking fountains as well for to satisfy your thirst. I don't have, because I don't have, like, a, say, a building like this or an item. It's in the items category. I don't have an item like this, like the news agent or the cozy kiosk, that reduces thirst. And somewhere along the way, I'm supposed to, maybe it's in research or maybe I get it, like, you can... It's a cafeteria. I don't know if it's a, like you have to build like a cafeteria room or if it's just something buried down here somewhere. But might, excuse me, it might actually be like a room that we get that will take care of all our patients' thirst and hunger needs. But I don't have that yet, so that is what it is. Um, so yeah, I think that's new in the first building is psychiatry, injection room, research lab. Oh, and then on the back side of this, I didn't really change, it's the chromotherapy lab. And I built it here because we had another challenge where seven patients come in with whatever this illness is called gray anatomy. So, yeah, so then it's like, well, I guess I gotta build this because I need it right now, and that's kind of why I built it. Uh, so then ran out of room, and people were trying, people were really requesting the ward a bunch. I had one Pans Lab patient before the one just popped up again to remind me to build this. 
Uh, so I had one before that and then psychiatry was just building up the queue line was like 13 people long so I built some more psychiatry rooms up here to help ease the load um, other than that so far so good I did have to take out a loan uh, to buy the second plot of land it cost fifty thousand dollars so i took out the two point bank loan of a maximum of fifty thousand uh, dollars basically just cover the cost of this hospital room right now and hopefully we will get making money i actually was in the negative there for a bit right here profit loss because my expenses just shot up keep shooting it I have 12 month trend, yeah, February is where I spent a bunch of money. And we're actually in the red, we were in the red for like $10,000, I think, negative $10,000. And now we're back in the positive, so we okay for now, and uh, we'll just uh, go from here. We should have a pest control room, cost $2,000 to build. The marketing room costs seven thousand dollars to build. A four by three minimum. Four by four minimum. What is this? It's like a work desk collaboration thing. Can you even get in there? I guess you can get in there from this side. What are all these? Just... Adds prestige to the room. Okay. Oh, no. That is not what we want. This way, though, makes for me come straight up. This cost me now thirteen thousand dollars. That's great. Love to see it. Have any assistance with the marketing thing? Customer service. Do I have any people stuck with the marketing thing? Customer service, training masterclass, stamina training. It's just emotional intelligence, so it doesn't look like I have anyone with the qualification. Might have to build a training room and just train some people in it. To start a marketing campaign, click on the marketing table or drop an assistant with marketing qualification in the room. General campaigns improve the hospital's overall reputation. Recruit camp recruitment campaigns, campaigns, campaigns attract more job applicants. Of various types, illness campaigns attract more patients exhibiting certain symptoms and improve your reputation with specific illnesses. Note unlock more illness campaigns by discovering more illnesses in each area. Hmm. 
Yeah, I don't have the money for this, so I'm not going to launch one right now. Not to mention I don't have anyone that can do it anyways. Uh, general research gives us $20,000. I mean, I mean, need some of that money, but... The mega scan. With the discovery of X rays, some scientists have speculated on the possible ex existence of Y rays. Clearly, that's absurd, idiots. Let's design a massive magnet and see if it's useful for something. Oh, <laughs> Lord. Okay. What should I research? Uh, just continue on this one. That's mostly done. Fracture wards required. Sorry, dude. Go home. I uh, or chick, chick, dude, dude, chick. Maya, you need to go home. I'm sorry, but oh, we need some nurses. Are you? I need some new GP offices soon. Someone is on the way here. If I just hire someone and drop them in there, they'll get in there and work. Starting to line up with GP. Patients might need to build some more of those. You're cold, it probably is cold in there. Yeah, I know, dude. But I unfortunately don't have the capabilities of preparing a research or a marketing thing at said time. So get lost. I could put a training room right here in this corner. How big is the space? Six by four. Yeah. Could definitely stick it in there. Which room do I have here? Four would make it tight. It's gonna be tight on one side anyway, so I have four wide in the middle here. Before I get to the end. Because then this sticks out. I have four wide in here to uh finest organic mooses. Make it into our juices. Build something. I need to make some shmoney first. Mm. It just kind of snuck up on me there, guy. But we got our one star hospital rating. Let's go. So, congrats on. Your hospital has been awarded a one-star rating by 2 Point Health Ministry. A fine town is deserving of a fine hospital, don't you think? Of course you do, that's precisely what you've begun developing. Top drawer. Your efforts in the world of marketing have not gone unnoticed. May your corporate siren song bring forth a bounty of cash-rich cash -rich sickos. If you grow tired of making us money, I suggest that you venture eastward into the county's most Toilety region. So we've unlocked two hospitals, and there we go. What I talked about earlier today, the cafe. Let's just go ahead and open the map. Conspiracy theories. Listen to this guy talk. Why the meltdown was in the state center? Abandoned buildings, mutated wildlife, eerie reports. You ask me. It's something to do with all the experiments going on in those secret government facilities. Actually, 
I guess I am one for conspiracy theories. There is really All very right. little reason to visit Two Point County's desert region, and even less reason to set foot upon its drabbest little town. I speak, of course, of Smogly, where popular pastimes include vigorous coughing and waiting in line for surgery. Well, I suppose everyone has to live somewhere. Yeah, I guess so. Everybody does have to live somewhere. New opportunities. Oh, hey, the map opened up. Don't doesn't look like there's anything out that way anymore. But we've DLC. These are all DLCs. So we've opened up the map quite a bit now. There's one, two, three, four, five, six. Six hospitals still to go through. God damn. That's just the base game. Not to mention all these DLCs popping up. Oh boy. I'll just go in here and uh, give you guys a quick rundown of what's going on. Don't have that much money actually. It's kind of sad. I guess people don't, there's no reaction immediately because, uh, psh, people don't have time to react. Let's just go to the overview, we're starting to make money at least, you can see we try and kind of trended downward there for a while, starting to trend back up so that's good. It's not like we've broken that point where we just start raking in the money, but that's, I guess, because I'm still actively building things. Start raking in all that bun bunch of money. When you start raking it in, the huge sums, that's when you kind of just stop building things in your hospitals on autopilot. I only have three of seven buildings utilized, so still got a lot of building left to do. Um, so I don't know where this was at last time you guys were here, the second building. But I think we saw the marketing uh, broom. Don't have a campaign going on right now. The only campaign I ran was to complete the objective, then I kind of forgot about it. Uh, but we can go in there quick and kind of show you what uh, it's all about. <sighs> so we have a bunch of. We have recruitment campaigns where you can recruit just the basic profession of doctor, nurse, janitor, assistant, or then we can go into more specific, and these are like qualifications that people have that we can uh, recruit, and then they'll show up as more in the higher se section. Uh, illness marketing, this. Uh, I believe brings awarenesses to the different types of illnesses as it says awareness campaign for all the new drugs our hospital is using bring more patients to the pharmacy this one uh, pump out an untraceable but effective advert to, on their frequency whilst everyone sleeps that should alert patients for psychiatry so basically whatever campaign you have launch here We'll bring more people in to get that sort of treatment. And general marketing gives you reputation a boost. And I think that's about it. Just a reputation boost. Let's go for half the year. We'll launch campaign. We have two assistants, I think, that are capable of running it so far. Yeah, this guy's got the marketing qualification, and so does this guy. So, staff. Can't believe I forgot to have done this. Staff customization. All doctors must be Sonics. Nurses. To Amy's. 
assistance to tails, janitors to knuckles. It must be done. <laughs> oh boy. Anyways. You're super really happy. I guess we could bump you up a little bit. Give you a little pay raise. Here we go. Back with the Sonic crew. Can't believe I almost forgot about that. But they're back. They're back and they're looking good. Um, okay, so anyways, you can see the GP offices are always piling up, I guess, for some reason. Um, like I said, I don't remember what was here last time, but we finally put down one of these pest control rooms. Uh, with the ultrasonic cannon, basically, I might be able to show on here. Basically, a patient comes in, is this the patient? Yeah, see, they have, uh, like, stuffed animals, basically, <laughs> stuck to them. Um, and you'll see in a second here that they'll, uh, fix it for them with this ultrasonic cannon. Uh, I built this ward here. Got the eight beds in here, I believe. Two, four, six, eight. Yep. Got our training classroom finally in there. We got another toilet here because it looked like people were not going to the bathroom over here. So more GP offices, but it's evident that I need more still. Uh, capture 100 ghosts. Got an achievement. There you go. Uh, added those psychiatry rooms early on and the pans lab. I think this kind of line was here. This side's new. Let's just go and uh, fast forward. So a nurse gets here. Train to staff. We did that. Need a nurse to come here soon. Okay, got a nurse there finally. And this person's gonna go with the treatment. Oh, maybe our prices are too high. God damn it. Moat. So you'll see here, this guy goes in, and then the nurse uses the cannon and blasts him with ultrasonic sound. Ultrasonic. Um, I don't know. Waves. Oh, our expenses are so high. I wonder if we promoted people with too much money. We need that money. And that can't turn into a ghost. Prices. Go back to the base prices. I guess. Do ten patients, we can try that for sure. Someone get this ghost. Need a knuckles in here. Oh shit. I haven't seen one of these guys in a while. Yeah. Very bored and very thirsty. There we go. Got knuckles. Sucked it in. And then I bought this new building here where we finally put in a fracture ward to get fracture patients because that seemed like it was constantly popping up. And now, of course, that I have one here, there is. Well, there's one guy in bed. I was going to say, of course, I put it up here and it's not busy at all, but it seems like I was always turning them down when I didn't have the room. Now that it's here, it's not very much of a complaint. Uh, so here I have two more of the cardiology rooms and two more of the easy scan rooms, general diagnosis rooms, because they were starting to pile up. I really only had one of each of those and all the way back in the main building at the beginning. I should really add... Uh, no pharmacy just 
just for the future, you know, just for future reference. How's that affect our heat? Heat's still good. Attracting F is still shit because I've not done the outside, the hallways and whatever. And I'm definitely gonna need more GP offices, that is one guarantee. For sure. What we got here? Oh, we completed their challenge. More GP offices. Copy. Paste. Oops. And copy. Taste. Does that affect the heat? Let's just go ahead and copy <laughs> and paste. God damn it. We actually need a doctor for that room. Get in there, Sonic. Large radiator for heat, and then some benches for these people to sit down. On. I was wondering if I shouldn't put like maybe some drink machines here. many knuckles here clean up ghost on a uh, aisle three our money is getting quite low we still have a hundred thousand dollars are expensive that much that was last whenever it recorded capture ghost you got it knuckles which never fails to bring yeah. to her face. Life is like a carrot. It's your job to be a rabbit. Well, if nothing else, somebody just died. That's good. Love to see people dying in a hospital. Seems like our money's picking up here soon. Yeah, you guys need some training. I'll do that next time. Just want to see if we're going making money. See this person. What'd you just do? What is that? What are you doing? You going to clean that up? You clean that up? Staff promotion promote. What do you have? A deluxe clinic? The patient will wait. Let's throw one of those in there. I don't know. We'll see if we start making money or not. I don't know how it's going to go. We'll just uh, figure it out along the way. Cleaning up we Yeah, so I might need another bathroom over here. I mean, there's one right over here, but I guess patients walk out and around, and then they're like, Oh, yeah, I gotta go. And where am I gonna go? Right on the floor right here. That's where I'm gonna go. So, that's where they're gonna go. Um, but that's it. That's our one-star rating. Probably held you guys here way too long. So, I'd like to thank you so much for tuning in. If you want to help out the channel, you can like, subscribe, comment, do any and all of those things. If... Uh, you enjoyed the video today, and as we say up here in Canada, peace out!